sending sly broadcast messages from within your InvestorFuse CRM. That's what I want to show you guys today. To start off, a sly broadcast, for those of you who are not familiar, is essentially a ringless voicemail. You record an MP3 of yourself leaving a voicemail, and you can send that to a single lead that you have or multiple leads that you have, all from the comfort of being inside your InvestorFuse CRM. So let's take a look at how to do that. First, we're going to look at the bulk communication side. So I'm going to go to the Seller Leads app. And I have different views here, essentially different categories of my leads in the workspace. So some different scenarios you may want to send slide broadcasts is like re-engaging dead leads, maybe a, the, um, some that are on a follow-up sequence, any type of demographic that you want to send a general voicemail to. So I have a view here, dead leads, there's five of them. If I want to hit these five leads with the same slide broadcast, I'm simply going to go to my configuration workspace and then go to the slide broadcast app. Add slide broadcast campaign. And I can either send this blast to go out as soon as I configure it and press send broadcast now, or I can schedule this out at a future date if I may be working late at night and want to send it out first thing in the morning. If you're sending it out now, go ahead and leave this date blank. Callback number, you want to use a call rail number or some phone system number that is linked into your account so that you get notified when an existing lead gets back in touch with you. And the last thing I have to do after saving it is just attach an MP3 file here, an audio file. So I'm going to go to, this is just the one I have here. I'm going to go here. It takes a couple seconds to attach, and then you'll press done to confirm that. And I also have to choose the view to send blast to. So going back to my seller leads. I'm going to copy this here, those five dead leads, paste, and now I can send this out just by pressing send broadcast now. The other cool integration, guys, that InvestorFuse has put together is the ability to put these sly broadcast messages into your follow-up sequences, which are like drip campaigns. And that's very, very cool, very, very powerful, powerful stuff. So in an example I have here, I'm going to go to a follow-up sequence, and I'm going to show you how you can simply plug in a sly broadcast. So in my eyes, this kind of eliminates the need for setting a task, for example, six months out to a teammate to follow up with a lead, or one month out. You can just program in that MP3, on day whatever you have it programmed it's gonna land that message is gonna land in your seller leads inbox without you or your teammate someone from your company having to call them so let's go ahead and look at let's go to a cold lead offer sent here and show you guys how simple this is to program in so here's a cold lead offer sent as soon as you start the sequence they're gonna get a text message 14 days after that text message, they're going to get an email. Let's say we also want to put a voicemail in their inbox without having to task one of our teammates and also taking that time to make the call. We can simply add a second touch point here for our second action 14 days out. So I'm going to press add and I'm going to go to voicemail templates here. And I have this one already created offer follow up. And of course, you just want to make that wording match up the scenario and the days out. So in this voicemail, I could be saying something to the extent of, hey, this is Carlos. I wanted to follow up on the offer that we presented to you two weeks ago. Please give me a call back if you're interested about discussing this offer and making a deal here. And as simple as that, when this sequence is started, both the email and that voicemail will be planted in the seller leads phone 
without you having to do anything else. Just be conscious of when they get back in touch with you, you'll receive a task for that. So pretty cool stuff here, guys. All from within your CRM, too. You don't have to go anywhere else. You can program this in. You just have to record an audio file, and you can program it in right here to save as a template, just like you guys do for your text, email, and task templates. So you can have a nice list or nice storage of different voicemails, different scenarios, different wordings, all from right here.